Hello everyone, it's been a while since I've produced one of these videos, but today I'm going to go over an exciting new feature that we've released in our async OS 12.0, our sticks and taxi implementation. In this video, we're going to configure an external threat feed by going to Mail Policies, External Threat Feeds Manager. Once you've navigated to that, you'll add a source, and in this case I've added Hala Taxi, which is a public website halataxi.com where you can see a number of feeds are available. I'm going to use the guest.fishtank feed. And in this case, let me open up the settings. You can see I provided a source name. I'm using the IP address. You could also configure a fully qualified domain name, a polling path, and the collection name. The polling interval is set by default to one hour. I did increase the uh, age of threat feeds 365 days to the maximum. Uh, you can adjust that as needed. I've told it to use HTTP over port 80, and it does not require any uh, credentials to access this or the use of a proxy. Once you've submitted this, then you will need to go into incoming content filters and define in this case, I've defined an external threat feed. And I've said that if the attachment file info is from Hala Taxi, or the URL reputation is available in that feed, then I'm going to add a custom log entry, and I'm going to quarantine this message. Now notice I've said if one or more conditions match. Using that thread feed, I've taken a capture of the incoming message that was detected, just a snippet of the log entries. You can see that it defines that the thread feed source was Hala Taxi and that it detected a malicious URL provided. And then we added a custom log entry calling external thread feeds used. We hope you enjoy this video. Look for more on the exciting new release of 12.0.